it's, in fact, I'm little doubtful whether it is right or wrong after this panel discussion because what is going to happen? You are going to judge me on those parameters. Architect is a criminal. Okay, because I'm going to show you a project, but I'm show, going to show you a project in your city. So generally, I do not like to show the project of the same city because everybody is knowing about it more than me. So uh, today the project is Eden Greens Nagpur. The story started 15 years back. Generally, a project of this magnitude shall take four to five years maximum, but this project has taken 15 years and not yet fully complete. And uh, many of you know the exact reason. See, Theresa is laughing there. Okay, so uh, I've done few projects in uh, Nagpur, like I've done this building, which is uh, Kukreja Embassy. Uh, we got some best residential building award for this, uh, I think two years back. Uh, then we are doing this Capital Waste 19, uh, which is supposed to be the tallest building, already the construction has started. I've done one small uh, engineering college with entire master plan of VM Engineering College. I don't even know exact location of that in Nagpur because I did that uh, some 15 years back. I'm showing you this particular project because there's a, a linkage. This is a project which I did outskirts of Mumbai where Bhinder ends, a small place. When the client took me there in 2006, uh, there were only ground plus three buildings and then I designed this for him, the master plan, 150 acres and everybody was actually against it. Uh, all the partners, they said 45 storey building is not going to work. And then the first phase which I completed was 14 storey towers, second was 22, third is 30, the last time completing is 36, already 9,000 apartments handed over and I'm sure the central commercial building, what it is visible, it may not be commercial building, but it will be a high-rise tower for sure. So the city grows, the requirement changes, and something which is absolutely seems uh, impossible, and it becomes possible over a period of time. So the development is inevitable, whether environment friendly or not environment friendly, it is bound to happen because there is a need. So Something similar happened. Uh, this client of mine uh, came to me to design a township, 180 acres township. And uh, I said, well, what to do with this township? Because this is outskirts of Nagpur. And that time, I had just completed this one uh, hotel in Kumbhalgarh. So here also the story started same with the client said, whatever you want to do, you design a building. So for the first time I visited Kumbhalgarh, I saw what is there. These are the photos of actual Kumbhalgarh. There is a fort and there is a palace inside the fort. So I actually replicated that into my design and we made this one of the biggest hotel in Kumbhalgarh. There are more than 40, 50 hotels there. So this became a hotel where the destination marriages happen. And we use the planes uh, very nicely. We had this 80 rooms with the swimming pool attached to each room. And then this was known for destination marriages. So I thought to uh, use the same idea again. So you can see that fort architecture and palace architecture replicated inside the hotel. This is not working. Eh? Okay, so we are talking about now the Nagpur project. So when I started the design, it was again a destination marriage resort. So we thought, who will go outside? It is, the, the, the plot is 13 kilometers away from airport. Of course, uh, it is much nearer than Lee Meridian to the city. Uh, I took almost like 50 minutes in the morning and probably this site will take uh, 20 minutes from the city. So this is much nearer. And we had started this project as a resort and probably this will be one of the best hotel in the city. So 
the client gave me that 180 acres there was one existing school nearby that was uh, uh, dp uh, uh, school what is that delhi public school yeah so on this side there is a dps and this was a barren oh, absolutely no trees there kind of site uh, where this is a kamti road now when i visited last time i saw it has been concreted and nagpur is always ahead in infrastructure because of the obvious reasons <laughs> whether you need or you don't need there is a metro line which is already started there so the work has already started and probably uh, this site will get connection with the metro station in next few years maybe probably one or two years so we actually uh, took a small piece of that that small piece was 35 acres and we thought of creating a attraction point first for the township which is going to come later but i never knew that that later will be 15 years afterwards so this is what is the current picture is and you can see even today part of the structure is incomplete so when i actually took this project many of my uh, friends said vivek you are doing this project i said yes okay but uh, it will never get completed so i said what is the problem well, your client is very very uh, uh, known for not completing the project so anyway this this will be the first project got completed and in fact i was meeting him today morning and i told him that the best credit or the compliment i'm going to get out of this project that i completed this project with you okay and he has got very very interesting habit he is very dear friend like i, I got uh, we are good friends for last 25 years and uh, i always tell him ki boss you have got habit of taking u turn so he says no 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 i take u turn for the good things for the right decisions so i said okay you take u turn twice so then he says no no i take only right turn so then four times so he has got this habit of doing things and breaking them and then he is always like we drawing the other dhumme but then maine ye aisa kar diya to boss what you have done you know ye aisa aisa ho jayega theek hai tod denge theek hai and that is why the project will never get completed so you know the proximity of this site more than me and actually when it started he had some different idea because uh, this client of mine has got habit and in fact he is client to caresser also so he got this habit of traveling and every time he travels he take a photo and sends me now we like we are going to do this i said boss done already three times change not no more changes so i had to actually inject many of the ideas and uh, i use a technique uh, where the client really doesn't understand architecture he only understand 3d drawings he doesn't understand 2d drawings so that is the best benefit i took and i issued the drawings and then he got them executed and he said vivek tumne malum hai kya kara hai mere se maine bola acha kara hai chinta mat karna and then once this mock up was done he said yeah this is what i wanted i said so uh, we have got three blocks uh, there is a club block there is this residential block which is a hotel and we have got this biggest banquet so i actually uh, tried to push this to become one of the uh, sustainable project so i incorporated all the features whether he likes them or he doesn't like them but then he supported uh, and i think he is very passionate he is more passionate because uh, somebody when he is more passionate he try to achieve perfection in that achieving perfection there are redos so that is the problem with him and then uh, we gave different uh, character to the building many options were uh, given i never work on classical architecture all my buildings you will find modern buildings contemporary buildings this is one and only classical building i actually did and before that that was that uh, what the resort what you saw that is the indian uh, contextual architecture but the european classical the victorian style architecture or neo classical architecture actually not 
my kind of uh, work but then we adopted that and we use the features uh, now for environment so actually all those windows are sunken windows and not sunken by one or two feet they're like two and a half feet sunken windows and they give those double wall kind of impact so that the Nagpur heat can be taken care of so all my corners are coming out and they are giving proper protection and Nagpur has got a fantastic weather condition for six months at least where you don't require AC but when the extreme heat is there you require proper shadow protection so we use the feature of those classical architecture and we try to achieve that uh, sun shading devices and then uh, we created those lot of lawns and gazebos in between those spaces and this was one man-made lake which was artificial lake we did uh, inside that nine hole golf course and we had very interesting ideas like this is a destination marriage location where you will have different functions so lakeside or at the end there should be some gazebo in fact I was suggesting series of villas in the periphery where actually uh, people can stay uh, in fact the place can stay and you can see the clubhouse has got direct view of that lake and complete golf course on one side and the other side there will be this township coming up which will have this uh, full view of a lake and uh, golf course so the banquet the concept was very clear he said I want the biggest banquet in the central India because that time I think we didn't really have a uh, banquet of uh, uh, this uh, reliance and uh, no, 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 I'm talking about the India level so he showed me a lot of those different projects right from Calcutta to uh, you know we went different locations Bangalore we went we went for um, in fact Goa we saw two hotels and then he said I want bigger than them so that was the basic concept so this bank block was the first primary requirement he wanted this to be completed and then we had this uh, biggest banquet there so this is the floor plan and then this is the reflected ceiling plan so we had a huge chandelier a series of chandeliers and then a uh, lot of uh, interior designing was done so in fact there was a point of time when I got tired of designing I said boss interior is not my cup of tea you appoint somebody else and then there are number of interior designers he had and uh, few of these are my renders few of them are done from outside but we kept on giving him options and he kept on traveling and every trip he used to send the picture a reference picture so the alternative come from there and then this was uh, the pre-function and this is what is the actual photo this is the actual photo of the pre-function this was the render of the banquet and this is the actual banquet so how many of you have actually visited this place can I can I just okay many of you but those who have not seen now probably next time they see and they remember me and then abhi koi gali mat dena udar ja ke denge these are again the photos and this is a club block so this the requirement started from just 2 lakh square feet and then it kept on expanding अच्छा विवेक एक काम करते ग्राउंड प्लस थ्री है ना इसको ग्राउंड प्लस फोर कर लेते तो मैंने बोला बनाएंगे क्या रिजर्व स्पेस सो वी हैव अट लॉट ऑफ दैट रिजर्व स्पेस एंड प्रॉब्लेबली वंस दिस टाउनशिप ऑफ दिस फ्रेंच टाउनशिप स्टार्ट्स ही विल हैव सम यूटिलिटीज बट देन इट हैज कम आउट वंडरफुल सो दिस इज ग्राउंड फ्लोर प्लान ऑफ द क्लब हाउस वी हैव अट अ ह्यूज स्विमिंग पूल इन द बैक साइड एंड एंट्रेंस अ ह्यूज पोर्च and one of the biggest lobby very grand lobby is there and you can see those uh, classical elevations so this is the top off and a nice uh, sit out area a huge lobby is there and these are few renders of the lobbies so this is that entrance lobby and then on one side we have got a nice restaurant a huge one 
now this is 99% complete so i just told him uh, today once this is completed i'll uh, bring the entire office here and show them see finally i completed this karke okay so this is on one side we have got this uh, club so all the activities of the club and then we designed this one portion where there will be a night club and this was supposed to be the biggest night club and just today we discussed on to the design of the night club so there is one uh, club kawali club club is coming up so this is the first floor so this will be a happening place once this club starts and then we have got spa on the first floor on the opposite side so this is a spa and so we traveled for purchase of furniture to china and we visited few spas there and we took the ideas from there and he said i want a spa where there will be a reception on one side there will be a big saloon then there will be entry for the ladies on one side uh, entry for the gents there will be a swimming pool inside a heated swimming pool and then there will be a lodge where the complete family will again come back and have a get together inside so we actually completed this on site and there are those treatment rooms uh, that golf course facing treatment rooms on top of this we have got this club suite rooms which are now completed so this is the atrium which is in those club suite rooms and periphery we have got these rooms so these are the actual photos of the suite rooms which are there and very good toilets with those french windows again golf course facing french windows and then this is the hotel block so we have got almost like 100 rooms here the entrance lobby of the hotel block this is the interior these are the actual photos and this was done by me then the lighting uh, we actually worked on lighting a lot because we wanted this to be a oasis in that entire dark space and then we actually designed that central plaza initially it was a water body but then uh, when the design evolved we actually used that this is the gate so the lighting of all these three blocks and that encloses that central place and that becomes a very nice function space and that indirect light actually you know, creates lot of impact in this central lawn so we have got those gazebos so we have got those live counters on the sides there are two lawns so on one side it is there on the other side it uh, there it's a spillover area to the uh, pre function area it doesn't work yeah so in the night it looks something like this and there is some function which is happening and this was a drone shot we took there is a video there is a music if you can put it on so the township is going to come on this part of it i was told that this is the place people prefer maximum for their functions and that's it thank you